are today's announcements. Today is the final day that we are marking Red Ribbon Week at Centerville Middle School. We are encouraging students to live out the healthy habits for their entire lives. Today we hi are highlighting the value of sports. Exercising can help improve students' sleep, combat this depression and stress, and make students more alert. Plus, if students play sports with others, they build friendships and connections. The info screens around the school show your teachers and other staff at CMS enjoying sports. Take some time to play some sports with friends this month. Attention any students interested in becoming part of the 2020 to 2021 yearbook staff at Centerville Middle School. Applications are located in the main office. Please complete an application and return it to Mr. Oster in Tech Ed Room 121. Applications are due by this Thursday, 1022. At the end of the school day, any questions see Mr. Oster in Room 121. Thanks. Attention boys interested in trying out for the 7th and 8th grade school basketball team. There will be an informational meeting in the gym lobby today during flex. If you plan to try out for the Humfield boys basketball team this year, please plan to attend this meeting. Coaches Masick and Oster will hand out information related tryouts, also PIAA physicals. If you are a virtual student, please contact Coach Oster through Schoology for more information. This meeting is for both seventh and eighth grade school boys. All students must check in with their flex teacher before coming to the meeting. Attention students, as a reminder, Google Docs and Drive are micro and Microsoft OneDrive are technology resources covered by this district's responsible use policy. These systems may be monitored for inappropriate use content and language and students should not have any expectation of privacy for the materials they store there. Inappropriate behavior with these systems, whether occurring in school or out of school, may be subject to disciplinary consequences. Again, your iPad is a school issued device, as well as many of the technology resources you use. All documents that you create in these programs are subject to a filter that recognizes keywords and terms. The conversations and chats you are having in a document are subject to the filter. Any inappropriate content and or language that is found will, will re be reported to your principal for consequences. Additionally, parents will be notified and the document will be shared with them. Please use your technology wisely. The student, I mean, Centerville Middle School Knights are pleased to announce that Dariana Patterson has been selected as student of the week. She has been selected because she is focused, engaged, kind, polite, personal, conscientious, cooperative, goes above and beyond basic expectations. Congratulations, Dariana, and thank you for being a positive role model at CMS. As of 1020, there are current standings of the CMS chess tour tournament. The Knights are also pleased to announce that Cohen Skiles has been selected as a student of the week. Uh, he has been selected because he is polite, kind, friendly, engaged, conscientious, diligent, hardworking, and works well with others. Congratulations, Cohen, and thank you for being a positive role model at CMS. Um, as of 1020, there, here are the current standings at chess tournament. Knights, 10, Minutemen, 3, Colonials, and Scribes, 0. Teams are simply getting one point for each game played in the tournament. So over the last three weeks, the Colonials or Scribes have not participated. The men, men have only once. For the tournament to run, students need to log in during flex by 2.05 p.m. And at least four people must participate. Today's lunch is bacon cheeseburger on a wheat roll and baked potato wedges. Today's weather is partly cloudy with a high of 73 and a low of 55. Tomorrow's weather is mostly cloudy with a high of 73 and a low of 50. Today is National Color Day. And remember, we are CMS. C, choose to be safe. M, make responsible decisions. And S, show respect. Have a tiny dancer Tuesday.